This is Scott Bauer with Prosper Trading Academy. And wow, all of a sudden, the cruise lines are back in vogue, back in business, maybe. Uh, CCL Carnival Cruise Lines, they came out with fantastic earnings, not just great earnings top and bottom line, but also their outlook, their projection, their guidance was far beyond any expectations. That stock rallied almost 10% after earnings here. When I look at that chart though, when I look at it from a technical standpoint, that's coming up to some serious resistance around the 19 or 20 area. So after this move in CCL, I would not get in looking for a ride higher. To me, I would have to wait to see if it can breach that resistance area between 19 and 20. If it does, then maybe I wanna get in for the longer term. If anything, now that volatility is after earnings really, really come crashing down, I'd almost look to fade this a little bit, perhaps by buying a put spread. RCL, Royal Caribbean, in you know maybe uh, conjunction in concert with CCL rallying from a technical standpoint, RCL to me, even though it's a $160, $165 stock, looks a lot more attractive than CCL does. So again, Carnival Cruise Line, I have to wait to see if that 1920 area gets breached to the upside, that's when I would hop in. Otherwise, I'd look to short it on this big move. This is Scott Bauer with Prosper Trading Academy. Thank you. Go to businessfirstam.com for where to see our show on TV.